Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Vikram. In this class, we'll try to understand working mechanism of finding maximum and minimum using divide and conquer technique. So the concept of finding the maximum minimum uh, using the iterative method has already been discussed in our previous video. If you haven't watched that video, please watch that video and come back here. And every video on our channel is going to be a part of entire course or a playlist. Our suggestion is to follow the entire course so that you can have better understanding of the concepts. And the link for the playlist is provided in the description below now coming to this class we'll try to understand the working mechanism of uh, uh, finding the maximum and minimum uh, by using divide and conquer technique so this is the algorithm for uh, finding maximum and minimum about this algorithm we'll try to understand in detail in the next class in this class we'll try to take this example and we will try to understand how we are going to find the maximum and minimum element in this array by using the divide and conquer technique so the concept of divide and conquer has already been discussed so what what is the what is that uh, the divide and conquer technique is we are going to divide the problem into small small pieces until we get uh, the sub problem which cannot be further divided so there we are going to solve the problem uh, of the particular sub problem and uh, all and the solution for all the sub problems we will find the solution for all the sub problems at the end we are going to get the solution so how this happens is we are going to divide this array into two pieces so on what basis we are going to divide is we are going to divide it by using mid element so what is the mid element it is 0 plus 8 by 2 so to find the mid element so we have to have the index 0 the starting index and the ending index so to find the mid element it is 0 plus 8 by 2 so the mid element is 4 so here is where the array will get divided array will get divided and the new uh, uh, divided means it is not physically it is conceptually on this part of the uh, array elements the uh, the problem we are going to find the solution on that problem of the uh, division we are going to find the solution so the array will be in the same uh, in the same way but we are going to uh, do our solution on the on the parts of that array so after division it is going to be 0 1 uh, 2 3 and 4 these are the elements okay so now the elements are 4 7 3 2 9 and then other half is other half is this is 6 8 1 5 and the indexes are uh, 6 5 6 7 8 now until which point we are going to divide that is the question so it is what we call it as a base condition so until which point is until the array elements until we get uh, the size of the array as a uh, two elements or one element if the array is having only two elements if the piece is having the sub problem is having only two elements or one element there we are going to stop our division there we are going to find the uh, uh, there we are going to find the solution so how the solution is found that we will try to understand again the division is done 0 plus 4 by 2 0 plus 1, uh, here the mid value is mid value is 4 for this division and for this division 0 plus 4 by 2 which is 2 here the division is done here the division is done here the mid is 2 mid is equal to 2 and the elements are 0 1 2 here uh, 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 these are the elements and the next half is the other half is it is uh, 2 and 9 and the elements or uh, the indices are this and on this 5 plus 8 by 2 which is 13.5 we are going to take the floor value sorry 12.5 we are going to take the 13 by 2 uh, which is 6.5 we are going to take the floor value we are going to get uh, uh, this one okay so this is where the division is done and uh, the uh, the elements are 6 8 and uh, the indices are 5 and 6 and the other half is this is where the division and <coughs> this one okay and so still we need to divide because this is having uh, two elements okay so where the division is done 0 plus 2 by 2 2 by 2 which is 1 so here is where the division is done okay so now uh, it is 4 and 7 and this is 
this is 3 and the elements are 0 1 uh, sorry indexers are 0 1 and 2 now until we divide this into two elements we are going to divide this this array into small small pieces here we are having only two elements and here we are having only one element so how to find the solution how to find the solution is we are going to find the maximum so max and minim, uh, minimum on all piece uh, on each and every piece here the maximum among these two is 7 and the minimum is 4 and for this the max is so we take ma and mi for minimum and here the max is 3 and the min is also 3 okay and by using these max values and minimum values uh, uh, we are going to so here here uh, for this sub problem the max is 7 and the min is 4 and for this sub problem the max is 3 and the min is also 3 now for this sub problem we have this data right and among this data among from this data how to find the max value we have to find the max between these two so if you if we are able to find the max between these two elements we are going to get the max value from this array and if you find the min value from these two elements we are going to find the min value among these elements so what is the max from this so for this array the max is 7 and the min is 3 so first one is max and the second one is min and what about this one so this is for this the max is uh, 9 and the min is 2 so I am writing max on the top and min on the bottom okay so now on these two which one is the max one so the max is 9 and the min is 2 okay and similarly what about these two problems for these two problems the max is 8 and the min is 6 and for these two the max is 5 and the min is 1 okay so now from these two so for this sub problem how to find the max and min so among these two among these two the max is 8 and the min is 1 okay and for this sub problem so for these two sub problems what is the max and what is the min value so the max is 9 max is 9 and the min is 1 so among all these elements the maximum element is 9 the maximum element is 9 and the minimum element is one it is very simple so from this array so the number the maximum element is nine and the minimum element is one so this is how the algorithm is going to produce the solution so this is how it is going to divide and it is going to conquer the solution okay so in the next class we'll try to understand we'll try to understand this algorithm using this algorithm and using the same example we'll try to solve the problem okay hope you got the clarity on this concept thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates and if you have any doubts regarding this concept please post your doubt in the comment section below and if you feel that this video is helpful to you please give us a like symbol and please share this video with your friends so that they will also get benefited thanks for watching